So this is our experience of the golden chopsticks, our first time going on the full I'd record it in a vlog. So we're all outside the London Grosvenor and I don't really know what to do, this is all a bit weird. So a bit of drama to begin with, I didn't get my QR codes but we needed to get in but luckily because we're on the list anyway we could get in. Um, I'm a bit of an idiot, sorry. Uh, don't know why I'm saying sorry to you guys, but you know. Anyway, here we are. So we've got this uh, chili and gin. Chili and gin? Chili and lime. Um, it's quite delicious. This really works really well. Really nice on the palate. Delicious. Like the little salad you get when you have Indian food. So that's the ballroom. I didn't realise it would be that big. And then I looked at the board, the table plans, and saw all the names there. There's some big names there like Gok Wang, Gok Lin, Ping Coombs, Jeremy, Pang, um, Ken Hom, obviously, there too. And we're on table, I think, 39. I'll pan over to that in a minute. I just thought I'd show you some names. I don't know why. Um, Anon Wong, oh, he won. Uh, best chef actually and deservedly so we didn't know a single person so we just stood in the corner by ourselves so that's Lek, Don, my dad, Jake, my wife Lydia, mum obviously look at all the, this is a fraction of the people that actually turned up in the end it was really good night massive fun so loud in here can't really talk to anyone I mean it's, it's busy it's, it's much busier than I thought it was going to be and um, it's good Look at all that free booze we got. I mean, it was awesome. We drank a lot. It is. Yeah, uh, yeah. I'm sorry about that, Dom. I will literally kill you if you lie to me about Jen again. <laughs> oh, he's so sweet, isn't he? <laughs> This is basically the Oscars for East and Southeast Asian food. We're up for best street food. I know I'm not up for influence, so this doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. But yeah, no worries. Uh, well, hopefully we win. Uh, if not, I'll keep you updated. Uh, either way, I'm probably gonna be very drunk later. So, a lot of these. <laughs> There's a line dance there too, a nice way to kick off the start of the evening and it made its way up to the front of the stage too and did a little dance up there. It's pretty cool to be honest. Chopsticks Awards, are you excited? Yeah! Good, good, good. Uh, first of all, a massive thank you to Sarah and Lucy for the amazing introduction, the one that I wrote. <laughs> Which is amazing. Uh, can I just first of all say, looking around the room, you look so... So when it comes to East and Southeast Asian street food, each of tonight's finest brings some very special at the table. So without further ado, over to Deborah. Yeah, the Award 2022 is Unamo Sukoshi. <laughs> I never even hear oh, of this award before. But thank you, thank you to the organizer. Hopefully this year the winner will get a pack of no. actual golden no. chopstick and not some transparent brick. Hi. <laughs> in all seriousness, thank you so much for the influencer award. Thank you to the judges and organizers. I don't even view myself as an influencer really. I mainly just talk shit on YouTube. And people seem to like it, I seem to build a career out of it just by tearing down professional chefs. Uh, meanwhile, I'm just on the internet going, Jamie Oliver sucks. But thank you so much once again, and keep eating your MSG. Bye. It was a good time. I wish I'd stayed longer, because the true story, this guy got out of a taxi and looked at me, and then he nodded, and I was thinking, that was weird. And then I thought, was he nodding at me because he's famous, and he thought I, I recognised him? And then it dawned on me that his face was Lee Ryan from Blue. And then I realised, and then I went to everyone, I think that's, uh, that was Lee Ryan from Blue. And uh, they all just mocked me and said, no, it wasn't, don't be stupid, you moron. And then who uh, literally did a performance at the end of the Golden Chopsticks during the after party? King Blue. It was him. I was right. It's sad that we didn't win. We're going to enter more categories next year. Um, it was a brilliant night. We kind of felt like outsiders a little bit because everyone else knew who each other was. I think maybe because they've been year after year, but I really had a good time, so can't wait for that. I hope you enjoyed this little vlog into what the Golden Chopsticks were. 
or are and maybe see some of you there the next year if you want to attend it's really good fun i was blown away by it really anyway in the words of mum happy cooking happy eating <laughs>